5G isn't bad for your health. There's a lot of concern because we use the word radiation when we talk about 5G. Radiation that 5G uses is a different wavelength. It's not a wavelength that's called ionising radiation. It can't disrupt your cells in the way that too much exposure to sunlight can. If you want to stay healthy around radiation, wear sunscreen. The people banning it aren't necessarily connected to the evidence and their priorities are more reassuring their constituencies. If you're not very au fait with the science, it's understandable why you might be scared, but getting to grips with the evidence and knowing that it doesn't harm you is a really important thing here. Big tech companies already spy on us. If you have a mobile phone that you carry around, that's effectively spying on you. If you use Google Maps, if you use Android, even if you use Apple, applications and devices are already tracking you. So 5G isn't going to bring anything additional to that party. We have already a lot of things in our environment that are man-made. So we have electricity pylons, we have wind turbines, we have buildings, we have street lamps. This is an addition to the built environment and obviously anything new is going to feel quite jarring. But I think we'll get used to it and I think we're not putting it in absolutely pristine places. Five G isn't killing bees. There is quite a lot of concern about colony collapse, and in some ways we don't know what's going on with that. But we do know that five G isn't the problem again because there's no mechanism for five G to harm bees. Five G is going to give us, as a consumers, a lot more connectivity. So your phone will be faster. You'll be able to stream video more quickly without buffering. More broadly, 5G is going to deliver a much more connected world. Instead of things talking to each other and to the cloud, they'll be able to talk across devices. So, for example, cars will be able to feed back traffic information between each other in real time. There's lots good coming from 5G.